The other day we had spoken in detail about what the incognito or the private mode is when it comes to browsing the internet. Many of you wanted a detailed video about the VPN option which was stated there. So here it goes. So in this video today, we will be talking about what is a VPN, what is the necessity for us to be using a VPN, how does a VPN work, how secure is the VPN network and some of the best VPNs which are available currently in the market. Security is a very important thing for everybody who uses the internet. So do watch this video till the end. You might probably learn something new with this. VPN or a virtual private network is an encrypted connection from a device to a network over the internet. Very simple. An encrypted connection is something which helps secure transfer of data from the source to the destination. It prevents unauthorized people from eavesdropping into what kind of traffic you send and receive. The VPN technology is widely used in the corporate environment to secure their sensitive data from hackers and their competitors. However, the usage of personal VPN is becoming increasingly popular these days because of a lot of incidents of data theft. Let's take a look at breachlevelindex.com, which is a website which shows how many data records have been stolen since 2013. The number is a staggering 14.7 billion units. There is also more information on this website with which you can filter like geography, industry and other options as well. A lot of big companies make billions by collecting and selling user data to third parties. If you may have seen, once you search for anything specific on the internet, a little while later you will start seeing ads which are very relevant to those topics in different web pages as well. This is a simple example of data theft. Companies these days are literally cunning. They use something called as cookies. They just give out a note at the bottom of the page saying we use cookies. Now what do these cookies do? These cookies are trained to do only one thing in specific. Collect user data. They collect the user data and hand them over to the advertisers in real time. That is how the user gets relevant ads for what he or she has searched for just minutes ago and the advertisers, they get targeted audience. And what does the company get in between? Millions of dollars. A few days ago, there have been huge accusations about personal data getting leaked out of Facebook. Whether Facebook has been hacked out of these details or the company itself sold it to a third party for a huge sum of money is immaterial to the common man. What matters is that data has been stolen. Personal data is more valuable than money these days and companies leave no stone unturned to gather these whenever possible, however possible. Now why should people like you and me use a VPN? VPN helps avoid hackers laying their hands on our personal data and keeps us worry free when we are using any kind of an application or a browser on the internet. Let me give out some specific instances to understand this better. If you use a public Wi-Fi, people will be able to see what all you have searched and downloaded over the internet. In order to avoid this, you need to use a VPN. If you use a peer-to-peer -peer application, you would feel that nobody should get to know what kind of things you have downloaded. Then you must need a VPN. If you do not want your network provider to know what you surf or download on the internet, then you need a VPN again. Now let us say you want to visit any website which is either blocked in your country or by your internet service provider. Then you need a VPN. If you really want to keep your privacy, you need a VPN. Last but not the least, if you want to hack someone or something and you need anonymity, then you need a VPN. How does it work? Imagine this. You wish to travel from New York to New Jersey. You take the road, take your car out, go on a long drive. You enjoy the drive, but then people can see you from the skies. They are able to see what you do in real time. Now the road is like the internet and the sky is like anybody out there who is able to see and monitor what kind of activity is going on. Now let us say for a fact that underneath the road we have a tunnel which is starting at New York and ending at New Jersey. If you ditch the road and take the tunnel, people will be able to see that you enter the tunnel and when you exit the tunnel, but they will not be able to see what you do in between, whether you have a stop in between, what kind of speed you're going. All these things are not visible to anybody who is outside the tunnel. Now this tunnel is like a VPN. People will be able to see that you're using a VPN, but then what you do inside that is anonymous. Now that is the advantage. 
How secure is a VPN? VPN is said to be 100% secure by every VPN provider. The outside world will only know that you have used a VPN service to do something, but they will not be knowing what that exact something is. This is for the outside world. But what happens if somebody is looking inside the tunnel? You will come across scores of free VPN providers if you do a simple Google search. But then how do they keep it free? Any information passed from the source to the destination must be logged somewhere. And this law holds good even when you're inside the tunnel. So this log which the free VPN is logging can be sold to any third party or an advertiser for a huge sum of money. That is how they try to keep it free for you while still be able to make money out of it. Absolutely free. Appalling speed at a snail's pace, I would say. In case of a premium VPN services, you are already paying a subscription fee to the provider. So they don't need to sell all your data to a third party in order to make money out of it. And they will be able to give you good speeds as well because they are making money out of it. So would you go for a free service or a premium service when it comes to VPN? Let us know in the comment section below. Now the question arises, what VPN services are the best in the industry at the moment? The fact that free VPN providers may still go ahead and sell user data to advertisers is the only reason why we are not mentioning them today. A simple Google search for the best VPN providers has returned 11.3 million results and out of the first 10 pages, whichever are the most popular ones, we have tried and tested them all. And out of all the VPN services we have tried out till date, NordVPN has come out to be the best. So we got in touch with NordVPN and have gotten a link specifically for our viewers. NordVPN has about 5,100 plus servers based in 62 different countries. So with a subscription of NordVPN, you get the power to send your IP address on a world tour right at the click of a button. It is also speed test certified by Okla to be one of the fastest VPN services out there in the market right now. NordVPN has been audited by a big four auditing firm which claims that they have found no logs which have been stored in the servers whatsoever. So the question arises, how much does it cost? To give you an idea as to how much NordVPN is going to cost you, a 3 year subscription comes in at $2.99 a month, which is cheaper than a coffee at Starbucks or a Big Mac at McDonald's. Over a span of 3 years, you end up spending just a little less than $108, which seems to be a really fair price when it comes to protecting something priceless. Your privacy. In order to make it easier for you people to go to NordVPN and subscribe to their services, we have left a link in the description below. Also, when you are trying to subscribe to NordVPN, please do subscribe to our channel as well. We hope you found this video informative and useful. Do give us a thumbs up by clicking on the like button below. Also, if you are new to our channel, please do consider subscribing and pressing the bell icon next to it. This will keep you notified about all the videos that we will be coming up in the future. So, we will be coming up with one more interesting video just like this only for you guys. Thank you.